The beauty in finding great pieces at affordable prices is priceless. Hey loves, my name is Chi and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. My channel focuses on fashion and style and some beauty and overall fly girl lifestyle, right? So if that is your vibe, hit subscribe and hit that bell notification so you do not miss an upload. Oh my god, I feel like I have not done a fashion video in like two months. <laughs> oh, child. Spring is here and I'm so excited about it. I mean, technically it's here, <laughs> but we're not really feeling it. I mean, on the East Coast. If you're in the New York area, we just had a very cold and rainy weekend. But nonetheless, the sun is going down later and there's like a foreseeable future of like warm weather. So <laughs> listen, <laughs> I'm gonna take the winds when I can take the winds. And I'm super excited about spring. I mean, listen, fall and winter is my season for dressing and looking all cute, but it's something about that spring summer that just, you know, just brings so much joy. So today we have a spring haul. As you guys know, I'm always shopping with intention, always have the goal of building an impactful wardrobe. And this spring I'm doing something different, right? I figured if I have a, like a must have guide, right? Like a checklist, it'll help me It'll streamline my shopping a little bit. It'll tailor it, it'll narrow it down, and it'll prevent me from, you know, buying unnecessary things. And I started to think about what my lifestyle was gonna be this season, right? Like, what do I wanna do for this season? And I wanted to make sure that I had a wardrobe that kind of supported that lifestyle and all of the things that I wanna do. So for spring and summer, I wanna be outside. I wanna make sure that I have like the best wardrobe to show up as my best self, my most confident, right? So I figured I shop a little differently this season and see if it helps. And I think it did. This is uh, my part one, an affordable spring haul. And the second part will be my luxury portion of um, my spring haul. And I would have done it all at once, but I'm still waiting for things to come in. <laughs> all right, so I don't want to ramble anymore. Let's get into the video. So this video is in partnership with Urban Revival. If you don't know what Urban Revival is, it is a fashion company, it is a fashion brand, a high street fashion brand, has a wide range offering from, from trendy pieces to elevated pieces to basics. It's all about giving quality at an affordable price, which I love about Urban Revival. And they got some heat right now. They, I, I cannot wait to show you these pieces. So there's a few things on my guideline list that I was like, listen, I am not straying away from this. If I'm shopping, these are the things that I'm intentionally going to try and find. And I think I found mostly everything on that guideline list. So the first thing on my guideline was spring dresses. And to be very specific, there were two kinds. I wanted a casual sporty dress that I can wear from day to night, right? And then I also wanted a dress that was like, a wow dress or just very flirty very cute very summer spring appropriate right and I found both of them well I found three dresses on Urban Revival so the first dress beautiful chocolate brown ruffle dress y'all okay so let me back up so the first thing that drew me to this dress, obviously, is the beautiful ruffles and details, but it was chocolate brown. And brown is my seasonal color. I absolutely love brown these days. And when I saw this dress, I was like, yep, she's going to turn heads. And I thought the dress was so cute, flirty, and fun. And those are some things you want in a spring summer dress, right? But surprisingly enough, when I first saw the dress on the website, I immediately was like, oh, that would be a great top. And I love a piece that is so versatile that you can wear it other ways outside of the initial intent, right? I tried this on as a top and threw on some denim cutoffs, y'all. And then threw, and you know I'm gonna throw on a nasty boot. You guys know I live for a boot in the summer. I love this look. This is gonna be a cute summer concert outfit this is going to be a cute date night outfit even drinks with the girls this is going to be a really cute look think about like a music festival outside that is a total vibe and what's going to be so cool about this dress too is that you can wear it with jeans right we're seeing this big trend happening right now of um dresses over jeans 
So I think this is going to be a vibe with some ankle jeans and then you have on your anklets and maybe like some loafers, like some chunky loafers or even like a pair of sneakers or even heels, chow. See, this is why I, lo I love a piece that you can just like style to the nines. You know what I mean? Like you could just style it and the style options are limitless. I love that. I love that. So let me know what you think about this dress. Do you like it as a top or do you like it as a dress? I like it as both. I think it's so, 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 so cute. Next two dresses I got from Urban Revival. It's not as dressy as that one, but they're just as good. Wait, hold on, they're just as good. Let me get them. So next we have this, we have like this light gray khaki kind of color dress. It kind of reminds me of a romper, but it is a dress. It comes with a belt which I love is long sleeve, but the material is so light. It's like this lightweight woven material that kind of resembles like a nylon. Love the cap buttons on here. And I'm obsessed with the big pockets. So this just kind of reminds me of a safari. And I'm loving these neutral colors for spring. And why I love this is it's so comfortable. So this particular dress is going to literally take you day to night right you can run some errands you can throw some sneakers on with it and then and then meet some friends for drinks at a local restaurant you could throw on some shoes and you could still wear the same look and still feel you could still feel polished and put together I love a dress that is just so easy to wear and so easy to style and that's one thing that I was looking for in these dresses is the ease of the silhouette, the ease of the color, the ease of the functionality of the dress, right? Like with the busy schedule and just trying to be outside this season, <laughs> I, I really don't want to think about having to style things, right? I just want to take it out the closet, put it on and go. So the next dress is similar, but it's so swaggy. It's like 10 times better than the other dress. Okay, so... <laughs> This gray nylon windbreaker dress, like the dress is so simple, but it's just so good. And what makes me so excited about these pieces is the number of ways I can wear them and the number of places I can wear it. And it's such a good quality and the detailing, you know, I'm gonna roll up the sleeves, I'm gonna pop the collar, I'm gonna accessorize. I absolutely love this. Now, with this jacket, I'm thinking amusement parks, I'm thinking barbecues, I'm thinking even mall runs, shopping days, right? This is how comfortable this dress is. And I also think you can throw on some stilettos and wear this to dinner. You know what I mean? Like, it's the, the, the styling is endless. I would prefer this, this dress with a pair of sneakers. Um, and not any sneakers, not any sneakers, like a, a lifestyle fashion sneaker. So no Jordan. Think Stan Smith. Think very refined, low top sneaker or like an Air Max, like a, like a lifestyle sneaker. Perfect with this dress. And I love the gray. So all of your accessories from your bag to your to your sneakers could just be pops of color. And one of my favorites, one of my favorites from the entire spring haul, and she wasn't that much. And that's the thing I love, like the beauty in finding great pieces at affordable prices is priceless. <laughs> so thank you, Urban Revival. Thank you. <laughs> so moving right along, um, another thing in my shopping guidelines was mini skirts. I'm a mini skirt girl and I love a mini skirt paired up with a boot situation. That is my go-to formula. It's always a Mary J. Blige reference for me. <laughs> so I found the cutest skirt in Urban Revival. It's a bubble skirt. I love a bubble skirt. Now this is trending for the season, right? Um, I'm popping up a picture of me in a bubble dress which I love, I wore it back in LA. And I was like, you know what? I wanna find like a cute little mini bubble skirt. And Urban Revival had one. Oh, this is so cute. Whenever I'm wearing a trendy item, I like to make sure that it's in like a neutral color, right? So it can so it can stand the test of time, so I can wear it more than once, so I don't feel like it's in my wardrobe one season out the next. And I feel like this is this is gonna stay. I feel like this is gonna stay. This is my vibe. This is this is totally my style. Look at the bubble hem. 
This is so good. Again, this is another piece that you can wear so many different ways, right? I'm thinking some high boots and a nice sheer shirt which would be really cute. I'm thinking just a white t-shirt, some sneakers, and like a jean jacket over to keep it casual and cool. So again, looking for pieces that you can dress up, you can dress down, looking for pieces that's so versatile um, and that speaks to your personal style. So this is one of them. Absolutely love this skirt. Cannot wait to wear it. Another mini skirt that I bought that didn't work out, but I'm waiting for a bigger size, um, but I wanted to show you is this crinkled mini navy blue patent leather skirt. I thought this was so cute. I'm popping up pictures from the website because I, I literally can't even get this on. <laughs> I can't even show you what this looks like. Um, but what I loved about it is one, because it's a mini, but I loved the texture of this skirt i love what the light does um when it reflects on it i love this navy blue too this color is stunning and it comes with this metal chain belt so i've i've recently been into chain belts it's a non-functional chain belt but it just kind of hangs on your hip so it's very cool and i'm loving this with just like a white crisp white button down um, shirt roll it up at the sleeves have jewelry popping out and some really cute like even like loafers or a booty or a boot um really cool just like a really cool like just like a really cool mini skirt kind of vibe and I absolutely love this so I'm looking forward to getting a bigger size so this is actually a large <laughs> I need an extra large I need an extra large I think the waist is gonna be too big, but it's gonna fit in like the hips a little bit and it's gonna be a little longer. Like this, I couldn't even get on. So we'll see. I hope it works because I really, really like this skirt. So for you slimmies, this is a great option if you're in the market of looking for a mini skirt. Absolutely love this skirt. So another thing on my guideline shopping list <laughs> was to get more tops. I feel like I don't have any tops. I have a bunch of t-shirts, a bunch of, you know, basic tops, but nothing that I can just throw on and go to work or I can throw on and go to an event and just still look very casual, chic, right? And very polished and put together. I have a few, but I don't have a lot. And I feel like I want to bring more options into my wardrobe. This is actually one of... Ooh something on my pants so this is one of the tops that I got from Urban Revival which checks that box right I quickly realized coming out of fall and winter that I really enjoy blouses because they're easy right they're easy and they're quick to just polish up a look um, with the right bottoms you can look stunning right so I wanted to make sure that I continue to build that part of my wardrobe up so um, I got this blouse Super chic, love this. So this is more like, like a satin chartreuse fabric, but what I love about it, it has this pre-wrinkled look to it. So you guys know my style pet peeve is being wrinkled. I don't like being wrinkled, but this I like because it's intentional <laughs> and it adds depth and dimension to this top. Um, I love the color of this. It reads a little, uh, pale yellow but it's more so on like the very light champagne light gold feel and I think this is going to be great paired up with white and cream um this is going to even look good with black like that black and gold sexy nighttime type of feel what drew me to this top on the website is when I saw it and I saw the seaming of the shirt I immediately thought about <laughs> Theo's Gordon Gartrell <laughs> top. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm putting up some pictures. <laughs> and it's and it felt so nostalgic to me. And I was like, oh my god, a Gordon Gartrell shirt. <laughs> so I brought it, but luckily it is not Denise's Gordon Gartrell shirt. <laughs> it is a well put together, well constructed blouse, and it is so pretty. It is stunning. It just kind of like cascades on your body I love the buttons the buttons are these gold like motif buttons that Urban Revival is known for and also giving like Scaparelli vibes I love it it's super cute and I love the lip button 
and it's like right there in the center. So super cute, super comfortable, and it's very lightweight. So it's going to be great for a work look, even a evening look. I absolutely love this. Let me know what you think about this blouse. And does this look like a Gordon Gartrell shirt? <laughs> okay, let me get to the next one. So the next top is like a shirt slash jacket. And I mean... I mean, you can't really see it from here. I'm popping up some pictures, but uh, I absolutely love. It has the shoulder pad, so it's gonna give you some structured shoulders. It has this lace, it has this lace detailing at the bottom. Um, it's cropped, so it's really sexy. For me, I'm gonna throw it on with some denim. <laughs> I'm gonna throw it on with some denim, but I think this would be so cute with like, a little skirt and I really like this top I love the detailing and it has the gold buttons this is great for going out for a spring and summer um yeah she's good this is a good one and the idea of all of this too is to buy the pieces that is going to just seamlessly go with things in my wardrobe but also help with my lifestyle right I'm starting to go to a lot of events and be invited round of applause to me <laughs> and I'm starting to be, you know I'm starting to get invites to things and you know being able to have those easy pieces that I can just you know grab and put on and still maintain a look is a vibe so she's a vibe love 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 her so I have two more pieces from Urban Revival another one is a top so this one is a denim top and you guys know I'm a denim girl, so this is just a no-brainer. And this is a cropped um, denim top, which is going to be so good with, like, white jeans. And it's going to look good as a full denim look. I love the fact that it's cropped in the back. So you can wear it as, like, a jacket or you can wear it as a top. So I really love this. Again, going back to my shopping guideline, I said denim, right? Whenever spring and summer come along, I got to get something denim. I just got to get something denim. Denim is synonymous with spring and summer. It's synonymous. It's one of those spring summer fabrics. Even though we wear denim all year round, denim is that girl in spring and summer. Think outdoor activities. Perfect. Perfect for it. Perfect for summer and spring. And the last thing I got from Urban Revival was this white button down dress. So I will say this. I love it. I love it. I love the big pockets here. I love the length. I love a I love a white button down top. That's the one thing. That's my favorite piece in a wardrobe. It's the it's the most versatile. And I and I talk about white button downs on this channel all the time, right? It's the most versatile piece of clothing that you will ever have, right? Um, and I love a full, you know, white button down dress in the summer and spring. What I don't like about this, it's not suitable for spring and summer. It's like this brushed poplin, right? It feels kind of like velvety a little bit. So it's a little heavy. So it's great for right now. It's great for fall and winter. So I'm going to keep it. Uh, because you can't go wrong with a white button down dress in your wardrobe like you just can't um but my thighs will be sweating <laughs> if I wore this in spring and summer my thighs would be sweating <laughs> but nonetheless I still love it I still love it I'm popping up some pictures I think it's essential it's essential and it's essential for me because I love a white button down shirt and I love a white button down dress it's just too heavy for spring and summer but I absolutely love it and it's, it's like it's great quality and that's the great thing about Urban Revival it's great quality at an affordable price so that's it so those are all the pieces that I got from Urban Revival. I want to thank the fabulous people at Urban Revival for partnering and sponsoring a portion of this video. You guys are fabulous. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, so let's get into some other things that I purchased from Spring. And all right, so I got a couple of pieces from H&M, um, mostly denim. Uh, I'm like 50-50 here. I was not that successful. Um, but let me show you what I got. So I got this crop um, 
like light gray wash jacket really cute something fun for the spring and the summer something to just throw on something very easy that I can just wear casually and it has like shoulder pads so it has like some sort of structure and it reminds me of a Frankie shop denim crop jacket that was out last year and it's pretty cute um, I should have got the small because your girl is losing weight <laughs> um but yeah i mean this is this is cool the denim is a very light weight denim i would have liked for it to have a little bit more body a little bit more weight to it so so the jacket could kind of have uh its own structure right because when denim is so light you lose the structure in it right and i and I love the fact that it has shoulder pads. So when it has shoulder pads, it needs to be a little bit structure and boxy. And I was hoping that this is what the jacket would do. Um, it does some form of that, but not really giving that boxy structured shape. So it's okay. Um, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it because I have use for it. But it's not what I imagined. And I do like it. And I do like it. I'm not going to say that I don't. So I was just a little... I was just a little bummed because I thought it was going to be something else, but it's cute. It's cute. I'll keep it. I mean, she's cute. She's cute. Now that I keep looking at her, like, you know, you have to look at things multiple times. <laughs> she's cute. She's cute. I mean, I'll keep the tags on her for the next 10 days and then I'll decide. <laughs> but yes, I got this. And then I got another denim look. <laughs> Again, lightweight denim, a light wash. I love a light wash for spring and summer. I love, I love this large cuff. So I'm into that right now. I'm into the denim with the really large cuff at the bottom. Um, I like them, they're just too big. So I'm losing weight, which I'm so happy about, but I have to remember that I can't keep buying the sizes that I was wearing, you know, two months ago because I am losing weight. So uh, I have to find a smaller size. These are a size eight. I need a size six, uh, which is crazy that I'm saying I need a size six. Like, I haven't worn a size six in jeans in so long. Maybe like pre-pandemic but um yes I mean does the eight fit it fits nice and comfortable but I would have liked it to kind of fit a little snug in the butt area and the hip area and it doesn't so I am going to have to try and find a smaller size or get it taken in and then the jacket that goes with it is pretty cute it cinches at the waist so it's like really tight at the waist and then it flares out so I absolutely love it and I like it together like the look like the complete look is fire right but the jacket just doesn't fit well it's it's big so I'm gonna have to find a smaller size so this jacket what jacket what size like I got a medium I need a small I'm like low-key feeling myself right now um <laughs> So I'm going to have to be on the hunt. Um, I looked online and they don't have a small or a size six in the pants. So I'm either going to have to get it taken in at the tailor or um, I'm going to have to try and locate it and find it. So I'm pretty bummed about that. Hmm. Womp womp. The next thing I got from H&M is from their studio collection, which I love H&M studio collection. They be having some gems in their studio collection. So their studio collection, I think, I think they do a studio collection maybe every two months or maybe every month. I'm not too sure the cadence, but they frequently drop these studio collections and they're more... And they're more like elevated pieces of H&M, um, better, higher quality, a higher price point. It's a, it's a bit of a premium. You'll see about a like plus a hundred dollar premium on some of the things, and I think it's well worth it. Um, the construction is great. The, the design detail, the quality is up there. So I really do appreciate and really like um, H&M Studio Collection. So I was able to get this vest. So this is a part of a set. So I have to find the bottom. So guys, if you see the bottom, DM me, hit me, hit me on Instagram, TikTok, um, my email. I'm desperately, not desperately, ooh, child, not desperately. I am looking for the bottom um, because I absolutely love this vest. I love the entire look. Again, it's giving that safari look, that utilitarian look that I am feeling for spring and summer. 
So even if I don't find the bottom, I'm okay. I'm good with the vest because I think the vest is super duper cool. The one thing about this is that this is a size medium and I need a size small. So this is a little big. This is a little big, but I might get this taken in because it's supposed to fit a little snug, right? It has like these hook closures on it. Like it's supposed to hug you and give some shape. And right now it's a little boxy because it's too big. So yeah, I, I, I'm not too successful in, in the H&M department, but I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to work it out. So either I'm going to tailor this because I really do like this. I'm going to find the bottom. And this is just going to be a look. It's going to be a look. And she's going to be really, really cute. So let me know what you think about the vest. I absolutely love the vest. And then I got a couple of basics from H&M, like t-shirts, tank tops, and things like that. Things for layering. Um, so I don't need to show you that. And then lastly, I got more denim. <laughs> more denim. More denim. It's crazy. So I went to Bloomingdale's and I got these seven for all mankind jeans. So they remind me of just like a wide leg trouser. So I love these. These are going to be super cute in like the spring and the summer. I can only imagine like you do a little crop tank top and then have like a little bandana scarf. You know what I mean? Like around your neck. That's so good. That's so cute, right? A little scarf and then like find a little cowboy hat. This ain't Texas. Yeah, I'm feeling that. I'm feeling that. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you like these wide leg jeans. I absolutely love them. And they're super comfortable. Super comfortable. Um, so yeah, so I got these from Bloomingdale's. And one more pair of denims I got. These. These are from. Where are these from? Oh, Free People. These are from Free People. And these are like a, like a horseshoe shape which I'm obsessed with. They're like ankle jeans. I love these type of jeans in the spring and the summer because they're great for sandals. They're great for styling with sandals. They're great to style um, loafers with, um, low top sneakers, right? They're really easy to style and they're pretty cool. And these are them and these are so good. I mean, when I tell you that I'm a denim girl, I'm really a denim girl. I wear denim all year round all the time because it's just comfortable for me it's comfortable for me it's a part of like my ethos a part of my my aesthetic I love a, a good pair of denim and that's it guys that concludes my affordable spring haul part two will come in maybe like two weeks I'm off to Vietnam and China so by the time this video goes out I probably will be in Vietnam so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope this sparks some inspiration, some interest. Um, I am going to link everything below and I will also include my sizes so you can kind of gauge your size if you're interested in any of these pieces. Don't forget to use my code where Urban Revival is down below. And um, don't forget to share this video, like this video, give this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to follow me on socials, TikTok and Instagram. All right, guys. So keep it safe, keep it cute. And I'll speak to you guys soon. Mwah. <laughs> Bye guys.